Uh, it was pretty good. We got it in, so me and Dylan, we, we pulled through and got 13-13 in the motos, uh, good enough to get us in, so not a fantastic day for comfortability on the on the bike and the track. It was pretty difficult for us, but uh, hey man, we got it in, so better than last year. Qualifying uh, went pretty rough for me. I had a, a tough start. I'm honestly not that comfortable on the track. It's really challenging. I had a big crash on a jump, <laughs> jumped off the track, cross rutted and went down again. I haven't crashed twice in a race I, I, in a really long time. I try to make the most of it. Uh, some people told me that the outside gate is actually not that bad, so if we get a good jump, maybe we can uh, get up there and talk a lot and uh, try to at least get uh, good for the Canadians. <laughs> I wasn't really part of the racing this weekend, unfortunately. I uh, felt really uncomfortable all weekend and kind of had to attack the track. And once the track got more gnarly and ruddy and stuff, it was uh, just not comfortable. Still happy to have that, uh, that opportunity to race here, but uh, it was a tough one. It was a tough one for me. Second moto, I went for Teros. It was all right for as long as I had Teros. And when I didn't have any more, like I had to pull in, get some other goggles, and uh, 
no excuse. It was not the bike. It was not the rain. Everybody had rain. And everybody had those conditions. It was just me not not being up to uh, up to the skills of these guys. That's it. It was uh, it was definitely a challenging one. Um, I think we kind of all struggled a little bit with just the feeling on the track and just feeling comfortable in general all around. Um, kind of from the moment we got on the track, it was super, super gnarly. It felt like back home in Canada, me and Dylan, I was just kind of pacing them right in behind him for maybe like five laps or so. And we had a pretty good like flow going. And then, um, yeah, I made a, a couple of mistakes. I jumped off the track and then I like kind of stalled it in the corner and like, yeah, just messed up a couple times, lost my flow. And then there was a freight train of guys, like probably five or six of them that just kept getting me and then I just never had a rest really and um, yeah not really the result I wanted but overall as a team um, not our best not our worst so we have to fight another year. Well the first moto I'm gonna write it off because first I got a decent start yeah I went around the first turn I think I was top 10 ish and then yeah first lap I think I, I passed Adamo because I split Adamo and Vial and then when VL cut back across, a rock kind of hit my roll-off. And I don't like wearing roll-offs, but it kind of had to today. But a rock hit this film on the roll-off and split the roll-off on the first lap. So, yeah, I was pretty much screwed from there. So I pulled in, I came over the finish line, I put my hand up, and I was like, hey! I need some goggles, but pull in for goggles, lost I don't know how many positions. And then from was when I put my new set of roll-offs on, it was like going from cold to hot. So they fogged up instantly, couldn't see for most of the race. And the last one was better for sure. Yeah, I was in around the top 10 to 12 area, the um, kind of the whole race. Made some passes, uh, got passed by a couple of guys too. But yeah, I thought it was good. My start was all screwed up because when the 15 second board went up, my bike actually stalled on the gate. So I was like panicking. I was like, shit, I hope this bike starts. Finally got it going, but I didn't have enough time to hit my start map. So I just kind of held it half throttle and I kind of tucked behind Kenny. So he was few gates over so I checked behind Kenny and yeah came out around the top 10 and was okay um, I was kind of happy with my ride and kind of not I would like to do more you know GPs and stuff like that to be have a better setup and be a little bit more used to kind of the gnarly tracks because this is nothing like we ride at home like there wasn't a lot of maybe fun to be had out there today <laughs>